afternoon. This is Lindsay Wabel with Ann Hoke and Associates. I'm here with Gary Cantrell and Greg Myers, also with Ann Hoke and Associates. We just wanted to pop on and give you a quick market update because there's been a buzz around this market we're in current. Greg, it's a buyer's market? Oh yeah, definitely a buyer's market, Lindsay. Hey, the uh, rates are really low. <laughs> No, we, we, are, we are in the midst of incredibly historically low interest rates. That is true. And um, I, I've heard rates 2.5, you know, it even even hovering a little bit lower than that. It's insane. I've never seen that. So, and I've been around for a long time, guys. Um, but the numbers were just released this last uh, week for uh, really our MLS area. And some of these numbers are just amazing. In fact, we're gonna go over just a few of these with you. Sure. But there's a link below, and if you want more information, just click on those links and, and, and get a hold of one of us, and we'll be glad to get this information to you, so. So what's the information, in a nutshell, <laughs> what's it telling us? Gary, you wanna chime in, or do you just agree? Well, <laughs> one of the key things is, it is definitely a seller's market. And um, when we look at the inventory levels of the number of homes uh, this year compared to a year ago, I mean, we're drastically down uh, almost 70%. What does that mean? That means there is uh, not a lot of inventory to sell. And uh, so when a market, when a home does hit the market, I mean, it's going very quickly. Days on market has been uh, reduced. Um, it's down 7% from where it was uh, a year ago. Uh, but we're seeing um, the number of new listings hit the market. Uh, that's even down uh, 10 percent, approximately, from a year ago. So it, it makes it very challenging, particularly if, if you're a buyer and, and looking to purchase. That puts you—you uh, you might find yourself more in a competitive uh, situation. And with that said, you need to have a great agent representing you because that comes down to negotiation. Yes. And availability and um, being able to find the home before it hits the market right that's correct and you got to work your way through the process you know how you have to construct an offer you have to work with the other other agents so all of that comes into play but uh, you know Gary touched on some of this but uh, oh my gosh when you look at just uh, December uh, comparing 2019 to 2020, uh, new listings coming on the market down almost 9%. But this is what really gets me is pending sales are up 76%. So we just keep chewing away at that inventory. Um, we've got months uh, supply um, comparing last year to this year. Um, we went from 3.6 months of inventory down to 0.8. I've been doing this a long time. I don't know that I've ever seen it in one. Well, what, when you say 0.8, what does that really mean? Three weeks of inventory? Yeah, that, almost three weeks of inventory. So that means if nothing else come on the market from today on, that we have literally three weeks of inventory and then we're out. Now, I've never seen that. That's incredible. That's incredible. And then the other thing that's really interesting too is when you look at um, over the year, um, price, the prices have went up 7.7%. So what that means, you can borrow money at 2.5% or 2.9% and your, you know, your appreciation's out way outpacing what you're borrowing the money for. So That's um, we've not, you know, so to say this is a, an incredible strong market, it is. Mm -hmm.